Early in the game, Boise State looked poised to dominate the Cowboys but a series of unfortunate events derailed the Broncos' lead. Boise, Idaho, on Saturday night, the Boise State football team dropped to 1-2 on the season after a 21-20 loss to Oklahoma State University, with the Broncos' third game of the 2021 season in the books, Boise State head coach Andy Avalos will hold a press conference, along with several Broncos players and or coaches, after the game to discuss the team's loss over Oklahoma State on Saturday night. Watch Boise State's post-game press conference in this article or on KTVB's YouTube channel. Scroll down to find the press conference video. The Cowboys improved to 3-2-0 on the season after becoming the first Big 12 conference team to beat the Broncos on the blue. The Broncos' loss wasn't due to a lack of effort as Boise State was able to match the Cowboys blow for blow throughout the game. It, the loss, really hurts, especially at home on the blue, Boise State Nicole Kikawa Kanaho said following the game. We as a team take pride in defending the blue. So we're gonna remember this feeling and take everything that we learned from this point forward to the rest of our season, we got a lot of football left to play. And you know we're excited for those opportunities. If the football gods were to bless both Bronco Nation and Oklahoma State faithful, Boise State would join the Big 12 Conference so this matchup can continue in the future as a conference game. Early in the game, Boise State looked poised to dominate the Cowboys but a series of unfortunate events derailed the Broncos' lead. With just over five minutes in the first quarter, Boise State held a 0-10 lead after the offense was able to march down the field against the Cowboys' defense. Following a 40-yard field goal from Meridian native kicker Johan Dalmas, the Broncos scored their first touchdown of the evening on a 28-yard touchdown pass from quarterback Hank Bachmeyer and tight end Davis Coder. However, the Cowboys displayed what Power 5 football looks like when Oklahoma State running back Jalen Warren scored on a 75-yard rush to bring the score to 7-10. Boise State in the second quarter responded with a 5-yard rushing touchdown by Oregon Duck transfer running back Cyrus Habibi Likio, his first as a Bronco.